Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Banished. Paradox Gamer here. Um, we've cleared out a big area over here that we are going to continue clearing. I've got some houses queued up as well here. Food situation is pretty good. Despite us having 53 laborers plus 21 builders running around, we have a, no problem feeding these guys. Only thing we are a little bit low on is stone and maybe iron. No, that's coal. Okay, we should get some more coal actually. Alright, so we got tomato, blackberry, red mulberry, and beetroot. I know we have tomato and blackberry. I'm not sure about red mulberry and beetroot. Nope, we don't have any of those two. And they don't want any sugar. Alright, so we got wool coats. Let's see, what is the inventory on wool coats? 355. And what is the cap on that? It is 300... 300... Uh, oh, 1000. Um, so we don't have lots of that. What about silk? We got almost a thousand silk. And we're not using silk at the moment, I think. We are using the wool, which we have a lot of. All right, let's go and uh, let's go and get some, um, some bead roots, shall we? And let's just use the uh, wool coats. So what is that? 100... 200? That's too much. 175? Too much. 170? Uh, 168. 167 to be exact. Trade. And dismiss. So now I got three things I have to um, to get in the ground for next year. And they're almost done uh, getting rid of all that. What about the houses? Why are they not getting built here? I know we had another build job over here, but still. Yeah, they're gathering stuff for this for this thing here. We got meat in the streets. That's why we built another bank barn. Let's grab some laborers and get rid of all this stuff here just grab all that we got an infestation up there and it's spreading quickly I can see apparently it's spreading across the road here looks like it's contained to that area still so that's fine where were we we were building the bank barn here still a little bit of, of a stockpile area there are we down to speed one because of the infestation let's go back up here People are actually walking up across this way here. I 
Yeah, I guess we can put a road there. Like that. So how are we doing here? We uh yeah, just needs to be built here. Okay. What about the houses here? Uh this one just needs to be built. Same goes with this one. And this one needs a little bit more. Question, do we need another forest hub? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't feel that organized to be uh, to be honest. I mean, I'll try to build more organized down here because I've got um, the room, the space, the time, the resources that I need. Food is skyrocketing, 37,000 now. I can't say I hate it. And we've started to build up a little bit of herbs again. We ran out of that, but... Uh, I've put in another herbalist. And the bang bomb over here is about to finish. Yep, there we go. So that should uh, be the end of their storage problems there. Houses are starting to get built here, so let's go ahead and uh, chop down some more stuff here. All of this got to go. All of this has got to go. All of this down here has got to go. It's just hoard some resources. All of this has been hoarded. It never goes away, it never goes bad, so you can just stack it up. Another merchant with coats. I don't need any coats. And we're now stacked on fuel again, 4,000. And that's even with mostly wooden houses. The wooden houses use a lot more fuel than, than stone houses does. So there should be a lot of laborers working here. got bison meat and leather in here but other than that I don't th I'm not sure what to uh, what to do here I mean it's late autumn. Okay, let's let's um, get some of the new crops in. Um, what have we got here? Cotton, blackberries, peas, spinach, tobacco leaves, bamboo, sunflower, more peas, more spinach. Okay, let's change these to lettuce and beetroot here. 
And then I guess Chestnut is a orchard. I think we have space down here for another orchard. We certainly do. So let's put that in. Um, yeah, we can build it over here. Chestnuts to go in there. Another merchant coming in here. Ooh, hemp, pecan, grape and tomato. I'm pretty sure we only need grape. So how are we doing after filling up uh, all the wool coats? Still got 262 here. Lots of wool so we can produce more. And silk. Still got a lot of silk. Alright, let's go get the grapes that we don't have. And let's pay with uh, some silk. Pay with 300 silk. And I need 100 worth of uh, herbs. That should be 25 herbs. Let's trade that. So we got uh, grape. I think that goes on the trees as well, doesn't it? Certainly does. Alright, let's get another orchard in here then. With grape. There we go. Should be ready for spring. Chestnut to go in here. What? I only need one here. And grape. There we go. So how much have we cleared? We have cleared most of the area here. We're just gonna go ahead and clear some more. We got eggs here too. Yeah. Still plenty of space on this stockpile here. Plenty of work to do. So how are we doing here? Candles? Oh, that's the uh, back alley. Production limit has been reached. Alright, what about the quarry here? We should actually start upgrading that pretty soon. We got 500 stone. There's not much to um, to talk about. I mean, this is just working. This is just food en masse. So what I really need is just to like fill this one up. Now we can count two, two, four, six, seven, eleven, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen uh, more stuff to acquire. And then we got it all. We got 2,000 locks, we got 500 stone, 1,200 uh, iron, 400 coal, uh, food 34,000. Somebody's cold here. Yeah, it's a long walk across the bridge.
I'm still uh, chopping down stuff here. Yeah. See, this is a good point. Whenever somebody gets cold, they don't go to their home. They just actually just go to the nearest house and get the get warm in there. That is a that's a good thing to note. We just got food here. Don't think we need it. How did we go uh, that? Uh, Infestation looks like uh, that is gone. I could uh, build some more farms here if I wanted to. Maybe a bank barn. This one is seven sex. Yeah, let's go ahead and, and do another bank barn here. We will need it. Like here. Get that built. Yeah, I think this is too hilly for a fisherman. I'm pretty sure of that. not gonna happen would have been a sweet sp sweet spot actually so I've been uh, been taking a look at the uh, new stuff that's gonna come in the uh, in the mod in the update some pretty sweet uh, sweet things so I think what we're gonna do is when that comes out and that should be uh, apparently before Christmas. We're gonna switch to that mod, uh, to the update, and uh, start all over. So let's see how far we can get here before that happens. Lots of stuff here. I still haven't explored this whole area to the right here. That's right next to our, st our starting point was right here. And we've done absolutely nothing over here. to put in here because we got um, we got everything going for us we can easily expand more farmland up here if we wanted to I'm just scrolling around here checking stuff uh, there's really not much to um, to do it's um, It seems like kind of a equilibrium we have uh, found here because um, we are hopelessly behind on homes. But the thing is, if you build those 50 homes, your population will explode. So you're gonna have to live with a uh, constant overpopulation. So you got two old people living in this house, they're not producing any kids. But eventually they will die and somebody will move in, you know, so it's not a big deal. Okay, let's just pause. What are, what are all these guys doing? They got a question mark on. Stone cutter. Ah, yeah, yeah, okay, got it. Yep, it needs to be upgraded. All right. Let's get on that. That will be upgraded to deep quarry. And 
while we wait for that, let's uh, take a break. Thank you so much for watching. Please consider leaving a like and see you next time. Bye-bye.